Simplify a over square root of a times square root of a times square root of a. Oh my god, so complicated. So we have to simplify it. But how? Have a look at the denominator. Square root of a times square root of a times square root of a. Of course, it can be written as, look, here we can separate these three a's. How many square roots does our first a have? Of course, one. So our first a can be written as square root of a. And then times, how many square roots does our second a have? Two. Here and here. So it is square root of square root of a. How many square roots does our third a have? Three. It is square root of square root of square root of a. So now, this is what we have. And we know that square root of a can be written as square root of a. Square root of square root of a is the fourth root of a. Square root of square root of square root of a is the eighth root of a. Further, square root of a is a to the power of 1 over 2. Fourth root of a is a to the power of 1 over 4. And eighth root of a is a to the power of 1 over 8. And this guy is only a to the power of the sum of the exponents. 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 8. So now, 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 8. Our exponent is 4 over 8 plus 2 over 8 plus 1 over 8. So it is 7 over 8. And here it is a to the power of 7 over 8. This is our denominator. So we've simplified the denominator. Then we should simplify our original term. It is a divided by a to the power of 7 over 8. And now I have a formula. Which formula? a to the power of m over a to the power of n is a to the power of m minus n. And of course, a to the power of m times a to the power of n is also equal to a to the power of m plus n. This formula is for this step, if you don't understand. And this formula is for current step. a is a. n is 7 over 8. And where is our m? m is the exponent of a. We know the exponent of a is just 1. a is equal to a to the power of 1. So it is equal to a to the power of m minus n. 1 minus 7 over 8. And 1 minus 7 over 8 is a to the power of 1 over 8. The exponent is 1 over 8. Of course, it can also be written as the 8th root of a. So that's our answer. Or, you want a bigger? 8th root of a. Here. Did you get it? Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to me. Check out these two videos. We'll see you next time.